Chef Cohen's whipping up a speedy savory soup with coriander, tomato, butter beans, olive oil, red peppers, onion, garlic, chicken stock, and a teaspoon of paca roasted masala. Grill the red peppers until they blacken. Place them into a glass bowl and cover with cling wrap to allow them to sweat to make removal of the charred skin easier. These have been sweating for a little bit because I love you guys and I don't respect myself much. As you can see, lots of steam coming off there. I'm going to very gingerly handle them and remove all this excess charred skin from them. Let me move that out of the way. And that is how you can see what's happening. Remove all this excess charred skin because what we want is a beautiful flesh underneath. And they're almost like floppy jellyfish. They're quite fun to play with. They're just so unlike the normal pepper where it's, it's firm and it holds its shape and you can sort of work with them. They roll over, they flop, they do their own thing. They're a completely different entity. Take the peppers and rinse any excess charred skin that remains. Next, pour olive oil into a large pan, add the chopped onions and garlic and cook until soft. Then add a generous teaspoon of roasted masala. We've got our mango butter beans. I've drained them off of the excess brine that was in there. Chop the red peppers and mix them into the pan along with the chicken stock and stir. Put on the lid and allow all the ingredients to simmer until nice and soft. That is food magic. The color is amazing. The aromas are even better. Once it's cooked, pour the soup into a blender so that it can be churned into a smooth texture. The rich roasted flavors will impress your family and friends. Let's see the main steps again. Char grill the red peppers, place them into a bowl, cover with cling wrap, then peel the skin. Heat olive oil and fry the onions and garlic. Then your roasted masala and tomato butter beans. Chop the peppers and add to the mix. Pour in chicken stock, stir, cover and simmer until soft. Blend the soup until smooth, season to taste and serve. We'll get to get this recipe SMS to you. SMS the word PACO, that's P-A-K-C-O, to double three seven two eight. The recipe and the ingredients will be forwarded onto you, as well as enter you into a competition where you could possibly win a East Coast Tables recipe book. Enjoy, till next week, ciao. With Paco Curry Made Easy, making curry is as easy as one, two, three. Choose Paco for the perfect curry every time.